You guys, lead generation and cold email don't need to be expensive. In this video, I'm gonna show you three tools that I use that you can get right now without signing up for a single subscription. So you can start generating leads and doing cold email all for basically free. Let's get right into it. So if you're not already familiar with AppSumo, this is a website where you can get lifetime subscriptions to tools that are usually in beta, but still really good. And if you sign up for a lifetime subscription, you can have access to these tools forever. So I call it basically free. Now there's a lot of awesome tools on here, but I picked my favorite three for cold email that we're going to be using to set up an actual cold email campaign to my leads. Now, these three tools are currently available on AppSumo, so go on there and get them right now while they still last. But if one of them isn't, go back to AppSumo and look for alternatives. There is always an awesome alternative for cold email available on AppSumo. So let's dive into the first one. So the first tool that we're gonna be using is called Scrup. And this uses your LinkedIn account to scrape emails and profile information from users directly on LinkedIn. Now, why this tool is so powerful, and if you've watched my other videos, this is going to blow your mind, is because not only does it get their personal personal email. So much better chance for delivery, much better chance that they're actually going to reply, but you get so many more data points on them that you can then use in personalization. And I'll show you what I mean in just a little bit. So looking at Scrup, it's $39 one time, and you can use this tool forever. It doesn't get much more free than that. So I'm not going to walk through the whole sign up process. Hit buy now, put in your code, follow the instructions, and now we are inside Scrub. So really clean, easy to use interface. But what the power is, I'm gonna to go to extract contacts from sales navigator. Now, any three lead generation tools, you're gonna to want to do the same thing. The first one, find emails to actually contact. So that's what Scrub is. Two, clean those emails, because you don't wanna send emails to things that are going to bounce or the invalid emails, because that's gonna ruin your email, it's gonna ruin your server. And then the third tool that you're gonna need is something to actually send those emails. So Scrub is how we find the emails. So now it takes us inside sales Navigator, and as you can see, there's a little Scrup export now in the top right. I've already added the Chrome extension. I've already signed up. This is stuff that you can do in two seconds by going through the instructions. So we're in Sales Navigator, and now I'm gonna to go to See All Filters. Now let's build a lead list together. Now I'm going to be contacting companies in the United States. So I want one owner's partners, CXO. I want United States. I want English. And I'm gonna do business consulting because business consultants love what I'm about to offer them. The next thing that I'm going to use is mentioned in the news. This is a new feature that LinkedIn added. You can actually find people who have recently been mentioned in the news. And now I'm at 189 results, which is pretty good. So let's go ahead and use Scrup Export. I'm gonna go ahead and click Scrup Export, and then I'm gonna put them into a list. So I can do a new list or an existing list. I'm gonna name this one, business consultants in the news, and we're going to get 100 of them. Actually, you know what? Let's get all 150. So it gives you a couple of other options here. Launch email enrichment after scraping. Yes, we want this. We want all of that data. And then I'm not going to export yet. So I'm going to go ahead and run this export. It's going to start from page one. And now this export is in progress. Now it works shockingly fast. Within five minutes, it's going to have all these data points. And I cannot wait to show you some of the data points that we can use with this tool. Now, I know I said you don't need to sign up for a single subscription. This is a assuming that you already have LinkedIn Sales Navigator. If you don't have it, you need it. If you're generating leads, this is just one tool that you already need in your arsenal. And if you learn how to use it correctly, it'll pay for itself almost instantly. You can send in mails directly to people's inboxes and you can hyper filter who you're sending them to using the tools that I just showed you. By the way, guys, you can always see how many credits you get when you scroll down on AppSumo. So for Scrub, the tool that we're using right now, we can do 5,000 emails per month, every month for the rest of our life. But if you wanna stack codes, you can get one more and double that. And in a lot of cases, you can keep stacking and stacking for almost unlimited exports. It's pretty crazy. All right, guys, the file is finally ready. So let's go ahead and export it and see what we get. So out of 150 leads, it got 83 personal emails. That's more than half. That is a ton of email addresses from this and you only get charged in credits for the emails that it finds. So let's go ahead and export to CSV and see what it it gets. So I'm only going to export the ones with emails and look at all these data points that we're getting, these beautiful, beautiful data points. And go ahead and start the export and then I'm going to refresh this page because the export should be relatively quick. As you can see, export ready. I'm going to go ahead and download this file and then I'm going to open it up and let's see what we get. All right, here we are. Look at all of these data points. Now I wanna show you some really important ones that this tool is gonna to be able to get that most B2B databases can't because it actually scrapes their profile information. If you follow my other videos and you see what I can do with AI, imagine what I can do using this information. We have the first really awesome one that we can use is their skills. So they've been endorsed for these skills. We can use AI 
to create personalization based on these skills, we have their profile description, what they wrote in their profile description. This is all the information that we'll ever need about them. And using AI and some of these integrations, we can use that information to create unbelievable personalization. But most importantly, we have their personal email and sometimes their company email. So in this email column, we have their main email. I'm gonna go ahead and delete some of the stuff that we don't need. All right, so now that we have a nice clean lead list, let's go ahead and save this file. Save as, I'm gonna give it that same name, business consultants in the news. Now let's go into the next tool and actually verify these emails to make sure that they're valid. The last thing that you wanna do is send cold emails to invalid or old emails. They will bounce back and it will destroy your domain reputation and your sending reputation. So this is one of my personal favorites and it's been on AppSumo for a while and I don't think it's going anywhere. It's called Rion Email Verifier and this email verification tool is gonna be my new go-to. It is so easy to use, the UI is awesome and it is so powerful. Let's dig into Rion and see what we're getting here. So $79, one-time fee for unlimited use, $79 for a lifetime subscription to Rion, which means you never need to pay again. So what does $79 get you here? So for $79, you get 500 verifications per day. So that's a lot, that 500 times 30, that is 15,000 verifications per month. That's a lot of emails that you're gonna send out. And then they give you a bonus of 100,000 lifetime credits, which I think is pretty cool. Now, if you wanna stack codes, they let you do pretty much unlimited. So if you're a, a big lead generation cold email guy, you can keep stacking them up and use these as much as you want. All right, cool. So let's get Rion. We signed up for it, we bought it. Let's get into the tool. All right, so now we are inside Rion Email Verifier. This is a super powerful email verification tool that is so simple to use, it's gonna make your life so easy. All right, so you get a couple options here and really you don't need many. We're gonna go into email verification and we're gonna go ahead and choose that file that we just saved, business consultants in the news. I'm gonna remove duplicates and start verification. Let's go to task details and see what it's doing. So right now it's working. The progress is zero out of 83. Now this can take a while because some of them, it's a little bit unsure if they're real emails or not. So they usually get like 98% of the way and then take a long time for that last one or two. All right, so let's go into tasks and results and we can see that it's running. We can see that it's 98% complete. I can download as an incomplete file, but I'm gonna wait for it to finish since I think it just has one or two more to go. And here are some of my old files that I've uploaded it into Rion. And I'm going to be honest with you, I know what this is going to say because Scrub is so good. The LinkedIn emails that it finds are incredibly valid. If you're using a B2B database, you'll usually see around 60 to 70% good emails. Using this LinkedIn sales navigator tool, you're going to get about 95% valid emails, which is unbelievable. All right. So the file is completed. We just clicked into the task and now I'm going to download the CSV. Before I do that, let's look at the results. 80 safe, one role, two unknown. I'm going to only only download the safe. So those three that it would have sent to aren't gonna get sent anymore. Let's download that CSV, call it the same thing, safe. It's good to keep your files named correctly. And now we've got a nice clean email file. All right, last but not least, we need a tool to send the emails. The one currently on AppSumo that I'm gonna be showing you is called Mail Meteor. Now, you might be questioning why you're using Mail Meteor. This is only allows you to sync one inbox. That's true. But if you're using Mail Meteor, that means it's directly integrated into your Gmail. So look at this, for $99, you can send 2,000 emails per day with a, with a G Suite account, or you can use regular Gmail accounts and email 500 per day. Now that is more powerful than an army of cold emails in a separate tool. So if you're just starting out, I highly recommend looking into something like Mail Meteor. It's a really great solution and they've done a ton of work on upgrading that platform. Go ahead and buy Mail Meteor, get set up, and let's show you what it looks like. So here we are, we're inside Mail Meteor. You're gonna have to sync it with your Gmail account first. You click sync with Gmail, you integrate your Gmail account, and you're ready to go. Now, one thing that I really like about Mail Meteor now, since the last update, is you can use it right there in the dashboard, in the cloud. You don't need to go into Google Sheets and use the extension. You can use it right here. The other really cool thing is if I come into advanced, I can configure aliases. So you can link multiple emails to your Gmail account and send from any of those emails. Very cool stuff. You can then set a campaign on autopilot so that it can run every day and execute a certain amount of emails. So theoretically, if you wanted to, you can configure aliases. Just add new aliases. I added one here already. Add 10 set 10 different campaigns and cycle through autopilot just like any other sending platform. But you can get way bigger volume because it's directly integrated into your Gmail. All right, so some options in Mail Meteor. It's pretty cool since their last update. You can upload contact lists. 
You can create templates. Here's some of my last templates and you can create campaigns. These are all new campaigns. So here's a campaign that I just built. We're actually going to run this thing. I told you we're gonna do it all the way through. I'm gonna show you. So we've got a couple settings here on the right, schedule send, autopilot, track emails, unsubscribe link. I definitely recommend using an unsubscribe link because you don't wanna email people that don't want your emails. Now, as you can see here, I inputted my own personalizations and the personalizations are directly from the spreadsheet. So we're gonna be uploading the CSV to feed it information. So let's take a look at this CSV that we're going to be feeding it. See these columns in the top? These are what you're going to call your personalizations. So for example, location. If it's location in that top column, that top row, that's what you're going to put here. Industry, same thing. First name, same thing. And we're going to be able to preview this before we actually send it, of course. So here you can toggle which email they're coming from. This one's going to be a lead magnet campaign from stellarbusiness.com. By the way, if you want a free award from stellarbusiness.com, go ahead and leave a comment and we'll make that happen for you. Then select recipients. So here's who we're actually going to be sending these emails to. I'm gonna upload that list that we just made, business consultant safe. Let's go ahead and save. These are gonna go into my contacts list and now we've got recipients, awesome. You're gonna to put together the email copy. You're gonna to put together your subject line. You're gonna use personalization. You can also add follow-ups if you upgrade your mail media account only. But to be honest, you don't need to do follow-ups if you're doing this kind of volume. Now, autopilot. Let's check this out and see how cool this is. You can set this campaign to run at set times and set days. And you can set the number of emails per day and the delay between emails. So maximum number of emails per day. Let's do 10. Let's keep this campaign running for a few different days. Let's activate it on all days. This will take about eight days for my emails to send. Awesome, let's go ahead and apply that. So track emails. I like to leave this on, especially when I'm, when I'm experimenting with new tools and new strategies, but it does add tracking code to your emails, which can affect deliverability. Now let's go ahead and do a show preview to see what we're working with here. So it's gonna grab somebody's contact information. In this case, this man named Andrew. You've been nominated for a Stellar Business Award in Greater Philadelphia, awesome. Location work in business consulting and services, awesome. Industry worked name worked again here. Let's see if this link worked. Awesome. I could even add his personalization to this link, which I think is really cool. So this would be pre-filled out for him. But for the sake of showing you this campaign, we're just going to go ahead and send test email. By the way, guys, one other huge benefit of using Mail Meteor is that the email looks like it actually came from Gmail. Most email sending tools will add special fonts or characters, and it won't look natural. In this case, it actually looks like it because it is a real Gmail to Gmail email. So let's go ahead and send that test email. Sent successfully. Everything's integrated. We're ready to go. Let's launch this thing. Send 80 emails. Boom. All right, the email has been sent to our 80 recipients. It will go over the course of the next eight days and I can track all of the responses here in the campaigns. All of these are scheduled. It shows me all the recent activity, all the autopilot information. And if I come to campaigns, I could see which one's active. Now guys, call to action for you right now is go to AppSumo, pick up these three tools. It's essentially free. It's as close to free as you're gonna get for really high quality cold email tools. And if I provided you any value here, please use my link to AppSumo down in the description and I hope you enjoyed. I hope this saves you a lot of money, not only now, but in the future. Now go generate some leads. I'm proud of you. Go get them.